today's video is going to be a top 10 Amazon products video. First of all, not sponsored by Amazon. It would be totally cool if it was, but sadly it's not. These are all purchased by me and my husband. Um, so yeah, I wanted to share with you some of my top 10 things that we've bought from Amazon. I could do a second part, so if you do end up liking this video, let me know down below and I can do a second version. Um, but this is gonna be mostly sort of pet and home things. Um, and yeah, just things that I found that have been really helpful. And I've tried to make it specific to Amazon, um, where like, so not products that you could just like pop to Tesco and buy, um, things that, you probably can find elsewhere, but you know, easy to just one click purchase on Amazon. So let's get started. The first thing is a photo frame and um, I will link everything down below. So the first thing is this photo frame and I will leave links to everything down below um, and tell you prices sort of at the time of filming this. So this was about £9.20 something so give or take it will go up and down. Um, but this is part of the Amazon Basics range and basically it's a photo frame where you can show off your Polaroids. They've got them in uh, various numbers of size. Um, I do want to get, I think there's one that's got six uh, places to pop pictures but this is the three one. So I've got three of my pooches on here and this just hangs by my bed so I see them before I go to sleep and when I wake up and uh, yeah I really like this and um, you can either stand up or you can you know hook it up on the wall which is what I've done so yeah that is the first thing the second thing is sort of another uh, photo frame accessory I guess you could call it um, basically I found it started off um, when I found an old photo frame of Darren's in the attic and it was completely filthy and broken and I thought you know what I want to try and repair this so I got out my pink stuff um, which is like a tub of cleaner and I cleaned it all and um, then I was like well how am I going to fix the back because the back um, you know frame easel had broken off and I managed to find these on Amazon and they're these little metal photo hooks so you get five in a pack and they come in two pieces so you've got like the little piece that you can, I've been gluing mine on with like Gorilla Glue. So you've got that and then you've also, oh, this is on, it's a bit greasy. Um, and then you slot it in and depending on what way you put it, you know, you can stand up your photo frame. You get a pack of five for about £6.50 and most of these things are on Prime because we have Prime. So uh, just so you know, but I'll show you. This was the first photo frame, but I've actually used it to fix like a stand up mirror as well. So this was the photo frame that I had to clean up. It's a, a little Disney one. Um, but as you can see on the back, um, I mean, it's not the best job, um, but um, the wooden sort of stand had broken off. So I just managed to glue one on and now it just sits nicely like that on the table and you know it makes this photo frame usable again um i like i said i've done it with another photo um like a mirror stand um so yeah i think they're really good and uh they're a way of saving a photo frame that maybe otherwise you would just chuck out so all about that sort of remending and repurposing so the next thing is a thing for my dog blue and it's a bit wet because it's <laughs> just come out of being washed um but this is the zella slow feed bowl um now i'd seen a lot of uh, like slow feed bowls but they always look too big blue is only a miniature poodle so he's like sort of westy cockapoo size i guess you could say miniature poodle size um and i was quite worried that this would actually be too deep for him but it's actually it works really well i found that when he was eating he was just starting to eat too fast and i could hear like him like sort of not like gasping for air but like he was taking in the air more than he was actually the food and so i use he has sort of like kibble cat size biscuit so it fits really well in here um it's just under 10 pounds um for this bowl but it's been like a total lifesaver it's got little rubber bits on it it is a little bit of a pain to clean so what i recommend is getting one of those um we've got a skinny brush like bottle brush cleaner yeah so from ikea we actually purchased like a long thin uh bottle brush um so um 
not only can we clean bottles but we can also clean this and it gets all into the the swell so he has been using that and it's been working really well for him the next thing is another kitchen item and this is by a planita i believe there are many different versions of this um but uh, my mother-in-law recommended this one to us um it's basically a eco-friendly replaceable dish brush um it says it's biodegradable ergonomic natural economical simple um so i will insert a little picture of the brush ours is pretty like it probably needs its head changing on it um but they say that 100 percent plants plant based you get two extra heads on this one and a loofah sponge so i've not actually used the loofah sponge um but this is what the brush heads look like and then they just go onto like a wooden and metal um handle so we've still got two of those left let me tell you the price and i'll also be able to tell you when we got it and how long so far sort of one brush heads lasted so we purchased this um early on in july it was 11.99 and like i said you get um, the handle three brush heads and the loofah sponge so we've not had to change ours yet we're probably coming up to needing one so maybe like every three months you would change it um but yeah i'm all about sort of finding eco-friendly alternatives and just being more conscious of like single plastics and things that you can like easily chuck out and add to landfill so that is my next favorite the next favorite is another dog item and so when we first found out we were getting blue i knew i wanted something to be able to hold his toys in and i got this off of amazon obviously that's what this video is um let me find the price of it so they call it the Morozzi or Morezzi cotton rope dog toy basket and it is $16.99 they do a couple different colors um but this is the one we've got the gray and the white so it's just like a rope basket and it just houses all his toys in downstairs it's not too big where it's like overwhelms our lounge we have it sort of under our coffee table so he's still able to sort of get to it and it's a nice height like i said he's a miniature poodle so he can delve in grab things i do actually have this is not completely full of toys i do have a blanket of his sort of about halfway up that he doesn't really use so i put that in there so he's able to get the toys a bit more and because it's soft it's sort of when he leans over he can you know reach in easily as well we've got another one that i just bought for our bedroom and it's not as dog friendly because it's got hard sides on it so we can't sort of lean into it to grab what he wants um but yeah so i would definitely recommend this one and it goes with our color scheme in our lounge so gray anything and then the th other thing i bought at the same time which is my next favorite is what we house pretty much all his other dog supplies in um so in the kitchen i'll insert clips of um the rest of the things i have i can't really physically show you because they're in you so i will insert a clip um but this is the pethy uh, large storage box again we've got um i believe the the gray version this is 17.99 um and what it is it's basically a large storage box like a fabric storage box it does have lids um like flap over lids but i um i don't use them because it's in a cupboard anyway so it wouldn't be functional like that um and in it we keep you know all his like doggy biscuits and things like extras of um and then in that or like all food is one side like all his treats and dog kongs and things like that and then on the other side i'll keep like medication um any excess leads receipts for like maybe coats we've bought him and things like that um just like extra things um poo bags all that sort of thing so it's been really helpful it fit really nicely into our kitchen cabinet and keeps everything away and yeah it's got that bit of organization to it so that has been another favorite of mine so the next favorite i have to show is probably one of like our top favorites and it is a shower head um let me find out how much it was okay so i can't actually find it through our amazon order so i'm not quite sure I'm pretty sure we did get it off Amazon. I just can't find it, but um, the, I will link a very similar one down below. Um, and you may have seen these all over the place. You can get them from various different places. Um, the one I've linked below and the one I found is the Rymer, Rymers one. Um, and actually, you get a three-month 
um, a six month refill on this of the beads that go in it. I don't know how this works, but if you have low shower pressure, you need this shower head in your life. It's not the most like glamorous looking shower head, I will admit. Um, my parents did have one um, first and um, you know, they've got pretty good shower pressure. So I didn't really necessarily like it at this because it made it like too much pressure. But oh my gosh, I will insert a clip of what like the pressure looks like through our bath tap it is like a trickle if you want your water warm it's ridiculous and Darren put the shower head on and it's like changed our whole shower experience it makes our pressure so much better I would definitely recommend these shower heads I don't know how it works with the little beads in it but it does and yeah um I don't know I guess maybe you're supposed to change those beads if it comes with like a six month refill of them I didn't know you were supposed to do that but yeah that has definitely been one of our top favorite like house improvement things that we have bought so the next thing I know I've been talking about sort of like eco-friendly like <laughs> reusable items this necessarily isn't one of those items but very handy and I do believe you could reuse these multiple times or you would hope that the receiver would um so if you watch other videos on my channel you know that i am into pin trading and um obviously I, a lot of the time i have to send pins and if you're a small shop owner this would also be good for you um they are these little bubble wrap bags i guess you could say they have a, a strip that you remove on the top so you can stick them down but it just means that like any pin you send let's just say this battery is the pin to pop it in or any small item you've got that you want to send you like rip it off and then it's all sealed in there nice and protected um i mean you could use these for multiple different reasons like if you were traveling you would be good if you're moving house and you've got a lot of like small items that you want to you know keep safe and then secure up um yes i definitely would think these are more reasonable i definitely if i get anything like this i try to be careful when opening and then reuse them um so you get 100 pieces of these which is a lot when you get them um for 10.99 um so it's probably not any cheaper than buying a massive roll of bubble wrap but easy to store makes your life like a dream and so much easier so if you need to use bubble wrap and you want to send small items then this is a good thing to have on hand the next thing is vacuum bags i think i watched a tiktok which is dangerous because i always end up finding something like either cleaning related or organization related and want to immediately go and try and do it um but yes i saw people vacuum sealing their bags and i don't know what it was about it that made me think i need those in my life i feel like it's a really like 90s early 2000s thing like your mother used to put like an extra duvet in them i know my mum definitely did um and like it would like the seal would always break or you'd have to use a hoover and um yeah so i, but I think they've like made a resurgence so um i've ordered quite a few of these uh vacuum seal bags i think maybe like six in total i've got i'm not sure i had to do two different um orders um but they are the Space Saver Premium Vacuum Storage Bags. Uh, they come with a pump, but you can use a hoover. I used the pump. I didn't find it. It was that difficult and, you know, it gave me a little bit of a workout at the same time. Um, so the one that I initially got um, was a jumbo four pack, um, but that's currently unavailable and was unavailable when I went to repurchase. Um, so I ended up getting, I believe it was a two pack um let's see how much that was and that was 10.99 but there is a five percent off voucher currently on there um i've used these for all sorts um extra towels extra linens um uh we've got a duvet i'll show you our linen cupboard is pretty much full of them we have a couple that are designated to clothes that don't fit us so um i am currently trying to lose weight Darren is going through a weight loss journey. He will be doing vlogs about that. He is going to be, fingers crossed, very soon getting um, weight loss surgery. So he has a lot of clothes from different sizes of things that don't fit him. And I thought, what a perfect way to store all these in some vacuum bags. Um, they're really accessible to get in and out of. Um, and so, 
yeah, we, I've used them for a ton of different things and um, I was like, I spent a whole evening back sealing everything. So I would definitely recommend them, especially for like extra pillows, duvets. It, it makes so much more space in your life and it's a dream. And then the last thing is a thing in our kitchen and this is our newest addition and I'm very, very pleased with it. It is a rolling trolley. Now, I don't know if you can see the excuse the little bit of mess i have this trolley here so this is one that you can actually get from hobbycraft ikea do a very similar one it's about anywhere between 20 to 30 pounds um and i was gonna initially buy one of those and then i found this one on amazon let me get it up it is the jacoi storage trolley cart you can get a three or a four tier one i got a four tier one because i thought that would be you know more beneficial it comes in black or white it's 25.99 so the same price as what you can find a lot of these um three tier ones i think it was the same price as that that i got from hobbycraft uh so we got the cream one it's four tiers and i love it as you'll see we have this little bit of space in our kitchen and we used to keep um because we ended up bulk buying like cans of drink and uh, bottles of water and we just ha would have these cases of them on the floor and i hated having them on the floor i thought it was messy it, you know took up room um and it was a pain to sort of clean um especially like when it came to cleaning the floors so we got this and it is a dream as you can see we have a lot of water currently on it um and different drinks um at the top i can put you know bigger items like bottles of extra bottles of squash and cereal and it does come with these four little hooks on like that you can place anywhere around them so at the moment i just keep darren's sort of lunch bag on there but you know you could put like tea towels or you know you could hang your masks or your keys whatever so if you're in like a flat or somewhere really small like we don't have the smallest a kitchen but you know it's not massive and it just really helps us save space and make it look more organized it is on wheels as well so you know if you like to host you can make it like a bar cart or something um but yeah that has definitely been one of my top amazon finds and i love it i think it looks really really nice and it's very functional so those are my top 10 items from amazon again i will link everything down below obviously prices will fluctuate as time goes on um and yeah so i hope you enjoyed seeing this video if you want a part two let me know because i definitely can do another round of this and yeah i will see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>